Hi, I'm Mark Folsick with Chemical Coders Association International, here to give you a quick tip on how to set up flow settings on your powder coating gun. So I want you to understand exactly what we're changing. So here we'll have our flow air running across the Venturi. It'll pull power powder through this pickup tube. That dictates how much powder we're gonna actually push to the gun. The second thing that we're gonna change is our assist air. Our assist air basically brings in air after the Venturi throat and regulates how fast that powder moves to your powder coating gun. So the first setting you'll see is my flow air. So here is where I'm gonna adjust how much powder I want to come out of the gun. The second setting is your assist air. This regulates how fast or the velocity at which powder will flow out of the gun tip. So to give you an example, of why you would need to increase or decrease any of these settings on the controller, you first need to figure out what kind of part you're painting. So a flat panel part, you might paint at a very high rate of powder coming out. And if you turn that rate up, you may need to adjust your assist air, okay? Which would be your lower setting. If you were gonna paint a corner of a box, you may wanna slow down your powder to give it more time to charge. Therefore, you can penetrate the corner better. So let me give an example of what this looks like coming out of the end of the gun and what you should see and what you should not see. In this setting, the assist air is set way too low, causing inconsistent powder spray. This setting shows the assist air too high, causing fading in and out of the powder spray pattern. And as you saw, this is why it's important to dial in your settings to maximize your transfer efficiency and have less rejects. Thank you for watching.